Hi guys, welcome to AWS DBA. In this session, we are going to see how we can create the DB parameter groups and how we can assign that uh, DB parameter group to your DB instance. After created your DB instance, you need to change from default parameter group to custom parameter group. You can't change any parameter values if you are using default parameter groups. A DB parameter group acts as a container for engine configuration values that are applied to one or more DB instances. If you create a DB instance without specifying a DB parameter group, the DB instance uses a default uh, DB parameter group. If you are using EC create option while creating the DB instance, then it will use default parameter group. You don't have any option for choosing the parameter group while using the DB create option. Each default DB parameter groups contains database engine defaults. Amazon RDS system default based on the engine compute class and the allocated storage of the instance. You can't modify the parameter settings of your default parameter group. If you want, you can create your own parameter group where you choose your uh, own parameter settings. If you want to use your own parameter group, then you need to create a new parameter group and modify the parameters that you want. After created your new parameter group, you can modify the new parameter group to your DB instance. If you update parameters within your DB parameter group, the changes apply to all DB instances that are associated with that parameter group. Best practice, you can create the separate parameter group for each DB instance. To create a new parameter group in the navigation pan, choose parameter groups. In this page, choose create a parameter group. In the create parameter group page, in the parameter group family, you need to select the DB parameter group family. Here, I, I created a, a tool version database, so I'm selecting the Postgres tool. In the group name box, enter the name of the new DB parameter group. You need to type the descriptions. Then choose create. Now parameter group has been created. After created parameter group, you need to associate this parameter group to your DB instance. To associate a DB parameter group with your DB instance, in the navigation pan, choose databases. Under then choose the DB instance that you want to modify and choose modify. In the modify DB instance page, scroll down this page. In the additional configuration section, you need to select your DB parameter group, which is created recently, and scroll down, choose continue. In the summary of modification, you need to validate a current value and a new value. Scheduling of modification, you need to choose apply immediately, then choose modify DB instance. It will take some time to modify the your DB instance. Now it is available state. You need to choose your database. In the database page, you need to click uh, configuration tab. And the scroll down this page, DP parameter group has been changed. We need to reboot our DP instance for reflecting this parameter group. We need to choose action, then click reboot and choose confirm. It will take a few seconds to rebooting our uh, instance. Now, DP instance is available state. You need to open your database in the configuration tab, scroll down, and you need to confirm your. Uh, DB parameter group. Now DB parameter group is in sync. So the DB parameter group properly associated with your DB instance. Next session we will see how we can change the parameters in the parameter group. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe and refer your friends.